Ah, goggle or smash, goggle or want to sort emotional baggage and get a one up. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, get a one up. <laughs> Hello guys and welcome back. Ooh, astral layer projection layer destroyed or <laughs> restored not just destroyed. God, I'm terrible at reading these things Anyway, hello guys and welcome back to let's play Psychonauts with Mio X Fu and well Just just look at this. This is fantastic. We are Gogolore the terror of Lungfishopolis because we're trying to save the lungfish who was brainwashed. And then he should be able to show us what happened to Lily. Where he brought Lily. Oh yeah, we can just shoot this guy. Forgot about that. Oh, I hope we couldn't have just shot the other turret. I'd be so pissed. I lost like two lives to that guy. Because I was dumb. There we go. Come on, you can't walk onto him from here? There we go. Thought so. Jeez. How do we get over there? Oh, I think we'll find out later. Aw, oh, man. I love this place. I, I, I do. I can't help it, you know? Ow! Come on. What'd I ever do to you except destroy half your city? Jeez. Talk about holding a grudge. <laughs> See if I ever come back to lovely Lin Lungfishopolis again, and I'll tell all my friends too, you know? Tell them how terrible you guys are to tourists and crap. Ooh, levitation up. Oh, no, ammo up. That's what it was. Oh, we're gonna die if we don't get some health soon. Come on, kill these guys. Kill these fools. Oh, pff, I didn't even see you. You jerk. What? Did that really pass through the wall? God damn it. <laughs> Man, I'm having as much trouble now as I did with my first playthrough, because I'm trying to get all these figments as well. But I'm trying to get them before I do everything else, so. Which is probably a bad idea. <laughs> Come on. Come on. You gonna die? No, there's a billboard in the way. Really? That? That can prevent me from getting hit, but not... Not an entire building. Oh, man. <laughs> Alright, let's get the figments. Now that we've destroyed all of these buildings and all of the tanks. You know, I kind of wanted to get them as I was going along, but I guess not. Whatever. I'm cool. I'm cool with that, too. Alright. So. Oh, love. I, I, I can't. I really, really cannot explain why I love just everything about this. Like, if you've played this, you know exactly why I love this. If you haven't, go play it. Again, I can't stress that. I, can't, I, I keep saying it, I know. But go play this game. It's fantastic. It's... Oh. <laughs> I'm having so much fun right now. It's not because I'm Let's Playing. It's because I'm playing as a giant Rasputin going through this city wrecking shit up. For no reason other to collect these figments. I mean, without these figments, I pro it'd probably be a much straighter shot. There probably wouldn't be as much destruction, but it wouldn't be as fun. Like, this is one of those levels where the figments really work. Because you just get to look at that... Well, you can, because it kind of unloaded. Look at that swath of destruction that I've wreaked upon this landscape. Any other game, you'd have to, you'd have to go out of your way to do that. And, like, spend no time on the actual game itself. Which, I mean, that, there's nothing wrong with that, but this is a game that you have to do that in order to get far in the game. Because, I mean, the figments power you up. The figments give you your, your upgrades and stuff like that. It's... Oh, gosh. 
can't even get the uh, can't even get the palm bomb up. Just look at this. It feels so good. <laughs> it's not because we're destroying Lung Fishopolis either. It's because we're destroying the perfect cartoon town as well. Like this isn't. It's a f completely fictional town, which just makes it even better. I don't know. <laughs> I'm probably going to be harping on this for the rest of the episode because I don't have anything else to really talk about with Lungfishopolis besides how much I love destroying it. Oh man, look at look at all the rail cars and trains and crap we're destroying. That's I love it so much. Oh wait, come on, really? Go that way. Oh man. So fun. What is this? What is this? We're here with a star of the popular city. <laughs> Famous sitcom, child Bubble star hates Gogolor. Buddy Finn. Buddy, what's your take on the Gogolor situation? Is he just misunderstood? No way! I hate Gogolor. <laughs> I can't imagine any one of my fans siding with the monster. He hates everything lungfish care about. Air, water, family, the economy. <laughs> Buddy, you'll be happy to know that the Navy has decided to pull out what they're most famous for. Airplanes! So rest assured, we can all look forward to Gogolor's imminent death. And to seeing you, buddy, every Thursday night at 8, right here on LVC. Thanks, and I'd just like to add that if anyone kidnaps a human child, they should take them quickly under the lake to the abandoned insane asylum. There we go, we can leave. Gogolor, come in. We have commandeered these vessels in your name. We can put them in position to help you cross Kochamara Channel to get to Kochamara Island and destroy Kochamara Tower. The thing is that, um, although we have the utmost faith that you will soon contain the area, Gogolor, we, uh... We just think it best to, to uh, yeah. We've decided to maintain our position oh, wow. here. Oh, wow. Yeah, Just geez. until you clear the area of all hostiles. You're a lung yes. fish, you're lung chicken. For insurance reasons, Gogolor. Yes. yes. That and for freedom. <laughs> okay, so two things about the broadcast. First of all, the most famous for airplanes. Do I have to even say anything other than that? Obviously I do, because I'm keeping on talking. But anyway, <laughs> most famous for tanks, most famous for airplanes. Oh, and there were boats, like two of them. <laughs> but anyway, I also love that it's very clearly Oleander who's talking. But it's also very clearly Oleander who's impersonating the child star. <laughs> Like, everything about this is just... Oh, it's... I... I, I love it, guys. <laughs> I really do. <laughs> Alright, we got one more Navy special airplane to take care of. And we can be... We can rest assured that the lungfish freedom fighters won't have to worry about insurance claims. There freedom! Cochamara Tower. Brainwashing the lungfish. We're almost there. Just a short couple of hops away. Alright, let's get these figments before we go, though. Well, at least get the luggage. You know what? Now, nah, let's get the figments. Usually what happens at this point is I just want to get on and fight Cochamara. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> I'm like, you know what? Screw it. I'll come back later and get those figments. And the ones I've missed on the other... The other mini island. Although I do see a mental cobweb. Nah, 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 screw it. Oh, man. I keep thinking these boats are gonna sink as soon as I hit them. Aw, that showed Rasputin falling well. in. We're sorry to report that the miserable and incompetent lung-faced navy is all but sunk. Great work, losers. 
Now, Kochamara himself will have to come all the way down here just to save our worthless <laughs> hides. Authorities are calling for a big parade in Kochamara's honor after he clobbers the annoying giant Gagalore. And if the parade is big enough, Kochamara promises not to destroy the city. Brush teeth more often, don't drool so much. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> no more about children, now about lungfish personal hygiene. All right, so let's destroy this tower. Oh wait, no, Kochamara's coming, that's Everyone, right. Here comes Kochamara! Epic battle between two giant monsters. This is the perfect end to the perfect level. Wait a minute. I recognize that shape and that must mustache. Could it be? <laughs> the battle to end all battles. It's better than any fighting game. Give up while you Goodnight. can, Gagalore. I know it's you in there, coach. I don't know where you're broadcasting from, but I'm gonna find out and make you show me what happened to Lily. Kojamara does not speak giant monster boy language. <laughs> the only word you're gonna need is ouch. Fight! Ram! Oh gosh, there we go. Good, we, we were able to protect ourselves from him. <laughs> I love that he uses the different move catchphrases too. Oh man, but basically this whole battle is use shield, hit him back with his own stuff until he falls. There we go. Okay, there we go. <laughs> also, that he's doing the little thing with the hands. Well, why don't I help you? Let it all out. Oh God. Well, we've lost all our side blasts. Oh shoot, we didn't hit the shield fast enough. Overly intricate combination! <laughs> Hard to avoid area attack! Alright, so anyway, after he does the hard to avoid area attack, that's when we want to wail on the guy. Because basically, we are not going to be able to hit him. Triangle beam! Oh! <laughs> okay, I don't know what that was. I've never seen him like fly off like that. But basically, yeah, we don't have any Psy Blast or anything, so. I think we could have used the Psy Blast earlier, but. Yeah, whatever. I always like using the shield more anyway. Oh, shoot. I thought we could dodge him. Guess not. Overly intricate combination! Yeah, we can dodge him that time, eh? Oh, no, we didn't. To avoid area attack. But we can get that one, so... Mighty oh, man, we were too far away. Mighty Ram Ground Vision! Okay, there we go. To avoid area attack. All right. Oh. I think this is the last time? Yeah, there we go. Got him. Coach Hamera. No more. Now Gogolore shall reign supreme. People of Lungfishopolis, I'm sorry I let you down. You didn't let them down. You enslaved Finally. them. Finally, okay, Tower. <laughs> exactly. Get ready for Gogolore. Get ready, indeed. Let's wail on him a couple more times, you know? Just just for fun. <laughs> Alright, so we have one last thing to take care of. A low resolution grid on this antenna. This looks so bad. Like, I've always thought that. And I, <laughs> I don't know why this is the only badly textured thing in this game. Like, everything else looks... It doesn't look amazing but it looks decent enough 
and here we go. Also, I guess my one complaint is we don't get to actually destroy the antenna. Oh, look out, Raz! Ha! Brought down by your own hubris. Literally. <laughs> Fine. Take control of this freaky toad. I don't need him to nab children for me anymore. I've got the brain of a little girl back in my lab that's strong enough to power a whole army of psycho blaster death tanks. Huh? What? You've got the brain of a little girl? I said in my lab. I think you've got the muscles of a little girl too. <laughs> Good one. I just love everything about this game, oh my god. Oh, the jokes are perfect. <laughs> Human child. <laughs> oh my god, you can talk. Who is that? It is I, the creature whose spirit was once, um, <clears throat> over here. Behind you? Yes. Oh. The creature whose spirit oh. was once enslaved by the evil one. You have unchained my soul, and now I shall repay you. Glad to help. Powerful human child. Oh, uh, great. Well, okay, show me what you did to my friend Lily. By the drowned spirit of Oblongata, it is done. Okay, thanks. Wait, what? Oh. Well. God, I didn't mean literally what you did to her. Like. Well, okay, I guess you're taking us to where you brought her, so that that works. Ugh. When it is your wish to travel across the lake, you may return to either shore and summon me with that. Thanks, oh. Hulking Lungfish. You know, you really aren't as hideous as people say. You may call me now by my true name, okay. Rasputin. The name given to me by my people. And what name is that, noble lake creature? Linda. What a magical lady. <laughs> well, Linda, I'm not sure I ever want to travel in your stomach again. No offense. <laughs> oh. oh. Anyway, I will see you guys next time. No spoilers. There's stuff up ahead. I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Psychonauts with me, Oxfu, as we go to rescue Lily. Take it easy, guys.